and a major success for India's LCA Tejas, the 5th Gen Python 5 air-to-air -air missile, has been integrated into its air-to-air -air weapons capability, while Pakistan's JF-17 was recently seen with the latest Chinese BVR missile, PL-10. India's Defence Research and Development Organisation announced the landmark achievement on 27 April, saying LCA Tejas was now allowed to carry the fifth-generation short-range missile. After Derby's short-range air-to-air missile, Python 5 is the second Israeli origin missile to be integrated with Tejas. Developed by Israel's Rafael, Python 5 is an all-aspect missile equipped with a dual-band imaging infrared seeker. The range exceeds 20 kilometers, and the missile has an optional lock-on after launch mode, and has limited BVR capability. Tejas is now equipped or tested with at least four air-to-air -air missiles, which include Python 5, R-73, Derby, and I-Derby. Tejas is gradually preparing itself for air-to-air -air engagement, but it needs long-range air-to-air missiles to emerge as a potent fighter. When it comes to range, Pakistan's JF-17, for now, is superior to the Indian Tejas. Just a day after India reported the integration of the Python 5 missile on its indigenous platform, Global Times reported the JF-17 Block 3 fighter jet, produced jointly by Pakistan, was spotted with PL-10 air-to-air -air missile, which also powers China's fifth-generation J-20 aircraft. The article said that previous JF-17s were armed with the old PL-5 missiles, and the new short-range combat missile represents the highest level of its kind. PL-10 arming the JF-17's newest variants is likely an export variant PL-10E, which is a domestically developed, fourth-generation air-to-air missile. According to Liang Xiaogang, chief designer of the missile, it is one of the most advanced in the world that is on par with the USA 9 x the JF-17 Block III fighter, which will also be deployed by Pakistan, is expected to gain exceptional close combat capability with the new missile, with the fighter jet likely to gain an edge even its more advanced opponents. The PL-10 is claimed to be a short-range IIR, with 90 DAG off boresight launch capability. Python 5, like most short-range air-to-air missiles produced since the late 1990s, is a high off boresight weapon, which can be fired at extreme angles from a pilot's line of sight. A fighter pilot can aim at a target only by looking at it, instead of turning his aircraft towards it. Whereas the PL-10 is known as an advanced dogfight weapon, designed to confront a wide variety of missiles such as the AIM-132 ASRAM, IRIST, A Darter, and the AIM-9X. The Chinese missile also comes with a multi-element imaging infrared seeker and a laser proximity fuse. Additionally, it comes with a thrust vectoring motor, with an off-bore sight capability of 90 degrees. Like the Israeli Python 5, PL-10 also comes with a lock-on after launch capability, enabling it beyond the within visual range BVR, capability. Although compared to PL-10, the Israeli missile's BVR capability is limited. What sets Python 5 apart is that it has been battle-tested in wars around the world and has turned out to be a reliable weapon against powerful adversaries. One cannot say the same thing about the Chinese PL-10, which supposedly comes with advanced capabilities according to its makers. Fifth-generation air-to-air missiles have far better seekers that allow the missile to see images rather than detect points of infrared radiation. So the real result of these missiles can be justified in the air-to-air -air battle, till both missiles are capable of short-range counter.